Squeeze Girl. I am at SEMA at the Optima Battery Booth. Batteries, very important part of our car, right? We never think about it unless it breaks. Um, we don't want that to happen to us. So Optima Batteries is a very good, long-lasting, well-known battery in the car world, and we're going to find out what's different about it today. So I'm with Ron of Optima Batteries. So Ron, can you tell me a little bit what is different from Optima Battery than a normal fashion battery? A normal or a traditional battery would be what we would call a flooded or a wet mud acid battery. It has a lot of free electrolyte inside of it. So it has like acid sitting there, in There's a lot of part. acid present in that battery. Right. So if you were to take the top off and turn it upside down, probably a gallon of acid would come out. Not good. Optima batteries are different. Yes, they are. Optima is an AGM design, uh, absorbed glass mat. If you were to take the top off an Optima battery and turn it upside down, there's no free acid present, so a lot of acid is not going to come out. In fact, no acid is going to come out. So what I understand, Optima battery has a spiral lead plate in each of these little cylinders. Correct. And between that is a glass mat where all the electrolyte is coming is absorbed in it. Yes, that's And that holds the charge? Yes. Okay. The, the, the glass mat is where you get the name AGM, absorbed glass mat. The electrolyte is present in that glass mat and is present inside the active material that's on the plates. Awesome. So with Optima battery, um, the advantage of having that whole design is going to be what for me as a consumer? Well, it's going to it's going to give you a longer life battery compared to a, a traditional wet battery. Uh, our field test studies have shown that you know you can have an Optima last up to two times the, the lifetime of a, a traditional wet battery. And as we were talking about last night, there's the guy who used a battery, Optima battery, for 20 years. Yes. Which is not normal, but it happened. Yes, he had it in his tractor, and then he had it in his pickup truck, and then he put it back in his tractor. And I think he, he the care and feeding of that battery was excellent for this particular individual. All right, so when we look at these different batteries right here, uh, there's a few different lines of Optima. We've got red tops, yellow tops, and blue tops. Okay. Can we just really quick go over what are the applications? Very simply, Red Top is an engine start battery. It's good for your daily driver. So my Studebaker, I, would go I with a red top. I don't even have a radio. Yep. I need a Red Top. Definitely a Red Top. Let's take like a lowrider car, has a stereo, has hydraulic, airbags. A lot of extra light. loads. A lot, of, a lot of extra loads on the electrical system. Mm -hmm. You definitely want the Yellow Top battery because it'll do good engine start for you and it's also going to provide the power needed for all the extra electrical loads. Very good. And then blue is the one last time? Uh, it's primarily our marine market battery. Mostly for boats. Mostly for boats. It can be used in other applications, but mostly for boats. So great. We found out Optima batteries. Red top for my Studebaker. Yellow top for people who have electrical gadgets in their car. And that's it.